YouTube, Facebook, Twitter, Tumblr. It's your boy. It's cold as hell. Out here in Kansas, cold, man. It's April 18th, and it's cold. Cold as hell. Can't believe it. I'm coming to you today because my boy Tyrese Lawless. One, two, check me out. Follow, follow me many, many, many miles. Uh, one, two, break it down. Let me, let me, let me, let me, let me break it down. Shout out to my boy Tyrese, man. He's doing big things down in Atlanta. Got things popping. You know, he's in a play. And I'm proud of my dude. He's making big moves. So if you're in the Atlanta area, make sure you check my dude out. He's definitely making things happen. He's making the dream happen. You know what I'm saying? And brother, I'm right behind you, dog. I'm right behind you. You know what I'm saying? You motivate me. Salute. But anyway, he brought up a question, and it was a very good question. Who are the biggest haters, men or women? And quite simply, I know the answer to that. Women. Women, especially black women, are the biggest haters. Like, And I know a lot of y'all probably like, oh, hell no, no, he didn't. Think about it. Think about it. All right, throughout the course of time. Throughout history, women have been haters. Y'all talk behind people's back, especially women. Y'all talk down behind people's back, especially women. Y'all always building yourself up, especially to other women. Y'all, I mean, it's for real. It's like y'all always got something to say. Y'all don't like to see, I mean, if you if it doesn't benefit you, you don't like seeing nobody come up. Now, this doesn't apply to all women. But this is most women. I mean, how many times have you been in this situation, ladies, where you sit up there, you're looking good, got your hair done, nails done, and you see a chick walk by who just happens to have a more expensive weave, just happens to have a nicer dress on, just happens to have some better nails than you, just happens to have some better, pretty, nicer shoes than you. And what do you do? You look at her and you be like... Mm, look at that bitch, that bitch, all oh, that fake ass hair, that hair. You know, that's the biggest oxymoron I've ever heard in my life. How the hell you going to have weave in your hair and going to diss another female who has hair, has fake hair? You have weave and she has weave, but you're dissing her for having fake weave in her hair. And then most females' excuses like, well, see, the way I wear mine, nah, homie, if it's fake, it's fake. You know what I'm saying? I'll give you a prime example. Okay, Mary Mary. Y'all know we've dealt with Mary Mary before. You know, got their reality show on TV. Same channel as the Braxtons. Okay. Basically, I get, I, it was like when they first came out, they took the Braxton slot. You know, time slot. Okay. Now, if you notice, the Braxtons don't come on when Mary Mary's on. It's always, you know, they, they all turn off season. So... But some of the Braxton sisters had something to say about it. They didn't like the fact that Mary Mary was on it. And they even took shots at Jill Scott and Mary Mary. You know what I'm saying? So that's kind of wild now. You know what I'm saying? I think that's kind of crazy how celebrities are even getting into it. You know what I'm saying? I mean, look at Mariah Carey and Nicki Minaj. You know what I'm saying? They go going at each other. It's just haterism. It's like natural for a woman to be a hater. You know, I mean, oh, I've seen women big up their best friends. I mean, you can have the ugliest homegirl in the world. And she'd be like, and then as soon as she come up, she might lose a little weight. You know what I'm saying? But, yeah, you want to sit there and still diss her. Oh, she thinks she all good now because she done lost some weight. Whatever, that bitch. I remember when that fat bitch was still, you know, you know like, damn, are you serious? You still talking about her? You know what I'm saying? That's how women are. I mean, and don't let it be a baby mama situation. Oh my God! I mean, I've been, I've seen situations where it'd be like, you know, a dude will be moved on from his baby mama. It'd be years since they didn't fucked around. You know, what I'm saying he didn't got a new wife, new everything, and the chick can sit there, baby mama, bitter than a motherfucker, hating whatever. He with that bitch. I don't know why he want that bitch. You know, I said I was doing this and that for him. What did that bitch do? What the fuck you? How do you know what this bitch is, what she's doing for him? How do you know what she's doing for him? You know what I'm saying? He's obviously happy. He's with her. He's not with you. So, why are women such haters? I don't understand that. And I know this probably may spark up some 
interest because I know a lot of women out there, you know, are like whatever. Like I guarantee you, somebody's gonna comment down here, or females gonna comment down here and say, "Why you fat motherfucker? Why you talking about women being haters? Why don't you go somewhere and fix your teeth?" Once again, hating shit. I get, I call it out. You know, I know how women are, and it's crazy how these ladies are. And I mean. To me, it's sad because, you know, these are our queens. These are the queens of our castles. These are the women we're supposed to potentially marry. You know what I'm saying? And, like, you look at all the reality shows that are out, Love and Hip Hop, um, Bad Girls Club, you know, just all these reality shows that are out and with women, predominantly women, and they hate on each other hard. Like, for instance, remember Flavor of Love? Remember I Love New York? The, basically, you could almost tell the men were acting more than the women. Like, you know what I'm saying? You have the guys in there. And to men, it's more of a competition. We're competing for our affection. We, I can lift more weights than you. Oh, yeah, I dress better than you. Oh, yeah, I know my wines. I know my wines. I know this, that, and the other. Oh, you know, but women, it's like, you know, basically... Women were sabotaging each other. You know what I'm saying? Looking for looking for all kinds of stuff. Like with the one chick, the blonde haired black chick, the, the, the ditzy one with the big eyes. Remember how I think she was on season two? But um, they basically tracked her down on an episode of um, Eliminate. You know what I'm saying? And pointed it out. That's hater shit. You know what I'm saying? Why do you hate on her like that? You know what I'm saying? Even though that... It's a ditty bitch need to go, but still, women are haters. Ain't no more to it, dog. Ain't no more to it. You know what I'm saying? Fair my district, nigga. Five years ago, right here, nigga. Yes. I told y'all, nigga. Yes. I told y'all, nigga. I am that nigga from the 